Stonehenge is one of the world's most famous landmarks, and it is mostly thought of as a circular structure. But what makes Stonehenge possible is the post and lintel construction, where slabs of stone are arranged horizontally and vertically. The most common example of post and lintel construction is the framework around a doorway in your house. The post are the vertical supports and the lintel is the horizontal span. The floor completes the quadrilateral that defines the entryway, and the shape is usually a rectangle. In fact, the front of most homes is another example of a post and lintel structure. The triangular roof usually sits on a post and lintel base. In the ancient world, this same type of construction was used with temples. We are quite at home with quadrilaterals. Square and rectangular frames are found throughout the house. In fact, most homes have a floor plan that is made up of rectangles and squares. While there are some circular shaped homes and some that are based on polygons, the overwhelming majority use quadrilateral forms. Why are square and rectangular forms so prevalent in homes? What properties of these shapes make them ideal for these types of structures? In this program, you will learn about the properties of quadrilaterals in order to solve real world problems. Specifically, this program will address the following concepts. The definition of a quadrilateral, rectangles and squares, triangular shapes found in quadrilaterals, parallelograms and trapezoids. 